What's up, my fellow freedom fighters? Welcome back to the shit show. So, you know what they say, get woke, go broke. Alrighty then, in today's show, we are going to study the correlation between getting woke and going broke. They're not gonna let you come in here and just help people. So let's help as many as we can before they figure us out. Once upon a time, there existed a TV show by the name of New Amsterdam. New Amsterdam aired on NBC starting in 2018, and for the most part, I would say it was a relatively popular show. Until that is, it eventually went extinct. Now, why did it go extinct, you may be wondering. Good question. Casualty of COVID, perhaps? No. You know what? On second thought, instead of telling you, why don't I just go ahead and show you? Make yourself comfortable. There's a couch over there. Is he okay? Yeah, yeah, he's, um, he's okay. I had Cephas answer some questions from a Harvard test known as unrest. It is designed to um, measure someone's level of social resistance. Social resistance. When people like us oppose the values and policies of the dominant culture. That's right. Um, what does that have to do with Your son, he feels threatened on a daily basis. Like everything he's earned can just be taken away. He's disenfranchised. But because his life is seemingly free from all this, because he can't name it, he's internalizing it. Name what? Racism. I think your son's tumor was caused by racism. Yeah, so anyone have any questions why that may have been canceled? Anyone? Anyone, anyone at all? Do I need to play it again? No? You guys good? Good. Now, Obviously, I can't say with 100% certainty that that abomination got the axe because of the get woke, go broke philosophy. But I'm about 99.999999, repeating a couple more times, percent sure that it probably has something to do with it. And based on the following featured review from GOAT movie and TV show review site imdb.com, I think it's pretty safe to say that I'm probably not the only human who feels that way. Quote, First three seasons are great, but stop it there. They changed the show a couple episodes into season three, just followed the reviews, and it's obvious. Apparently, this show thinks every white male should be erased from history and should not exist in the future. But I thought we didn't see color and we're not judging people anymore. Just like I'm not going to judge that spelling mistake. This show is so bad, everyone I know that used to watch it has stopped. And no, not all my friends are white males. Racism. I think your son's tumor was caused by racism. Wrong. You know what? Let's just go ahead and cut to the chase insinuating that a tumor can somehow be caused by racism is quite possibly the dumbest woke thing I have ever heard in my entire life. What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. Everyone in this room is now dumber for having listened to it. In conclusion, as evidenced by this New Amsterdam case study, getting woke more often than not will indeed result in going broke. And that's the bottom line, cause the great one said so. Take a shot, you've got everything you'll ever need. You fought, you're not gonna let up on a speed. Those knots, they got you, were only make-believe. Those 